What's going on everybody, Blades for here and today I have another video of Black Clover Mobile. Now inside this video guys, we're actually going to be elaborating a little bit more on the factions idea because of a special comment. Yes, a special comment I ended up getting down below from one of you guys. Um, actually gave me an idea for a video and um, that's what we're mainly going to be revolving this around. And that's going to be pretty much the ranking system of how the guilds are going to correlate into going into different factions such as the squads being like the golden dawn is the highest and then like black wolves being the lowest such as stuff like that how the anime really went so if you guys are interested in that be sure to like the video right here not this one of course the one that you're watching um like the video hit that subscribe button and then of course you guys keep up the pushing man y'all are actually doing phenomenal last video is at 73 views as you can see down here and we're actually doing very very good for at least our channel life sorry that this one came out a little bit late um was very very busy i'm gonna try and have one up really early tomorrow at least around like eight and then another one around 10 if i do have a some extra ideas here for you guys or you just spread them out through the days a little bit earlier for scheduling but enough of the talk we're gonna go ahead and get straight to it now in this video here um i ended up going about will squads in black clover mobile work like factions which if you guys don't know what factions are they're pretty much like a little bit of a clan system different than guilds here that work for different points in order to get certain like feats and certain benefits out of it okay and um, I went more in depth into this, like in this video. So if you guys really want a good explanation on it, be sure to check out that video as well. But down below, I was just scrolling here and I was actually talking one, but one comment that stuck out the most here, which was Alex SV. And he actually said, <clears throat> just some wishful thinking here, but I kind of want to see different squads get used as a sort of ranking system among the guilds. Now, this is something I was talking about a little bit, but he really went in for it. Now, he said, if the guild, if the game ends up having this, guilds will compete with each other to do various tasks, earning points for their respective parties. But at the end of the season or so, victors and losers can be ranked periodically and move up and down depending on points totals and other factors. Now, this is fairly interesting here because... It's pretty much what I was trying to shoot at, but he definitely said it a lot more clearer. Now, with guilds here, your whole deal is you can have a guild, right? You guys, of course, compete with each other and stuff like that. But at the end of the season, depending on like how many points you specifically get, you get um, moved up and down in a certain faction. Now, that is what I meant by like the type of like ranking type of deal like if you have really really high points you could end up going into the golden dawn faction right or the golden dawn squad you get the most benefits get some extra stuff out of it um probably extra currency for being in that squad extra different things that you can do and it provides more content for the player and more of a reason to like want to strive to be that high now um he furtherly went on like depending on where the guilds end up and determine the squad it will determine the squad that they're assigned to now he's doing it as a guild thing i'm saying as an individual but it could work either way but um they can try and tie it with stat counts just like how this uh, at least the show did that uh, he's going off and he's going off the wiki here so as i was saying here it says highest scoring guilds will go to golden dawn sub -sequ sequentially and to black bulls and then eventually all the way down to purple orcas and aqua deer right so like they would do stuff like that so you have the highest two and you slowly go down the ladder to see who are the lowest who are the highest who's the middle and stuff like that now that that's what i'm saying as to be um the key here if we did get something like factions that would definitely be way too cool the frequency i'm not even gonna lie it would be amazing to see here it's definitely something that i would love to see and um if we're going off of things like that i would like to see uh for the squads themselves let's say you get into golden deer you get more currency of course more gold because i have a bad feeling well good and bad feeling that imprinting books with aka the gear is going to cost a lot of gold if not decent bit because i feel like it, they make a big enough change to the whole gameplay and which if that's the deal here for you guys uh yeah we're gonna need some gold so I would, like they would offer like who knows uh some random gotcha gear type of deals uh some gems and then some uh 
some gold, of course, right? Something like that, something basic um, that's easily, that's kind of obtainable, but still something that people can uh, enjoy themselves for having, right? And I feel like that would make a lot of people strive to like want to play way more get better stuff for it it makes it a competitive environment for everyone now let's not make this now there's two sword at least two swords to this right it's a double-edged sword they can make it either really free to play i mean they can make it free to play and not and, and not free to play and that can be good or they can make it heavily pay, pay to win now that's the bad part about this idea in general i don't think i referenced this in my last video but that's the only downfall I could see with this whole thing happening, which I feel like this would be pretty dang cool to see this happen. Now, you guys let me know what you think down below in the comment section. And if you want another video like this or a video that like one of you guys, I can pick one of you out of the comments, be sure to just tell me what you think here. Come up with a good video idea that you guys wanna see. Want me to cover? I'll be all ears. I read all you guys' comments, as you can tell. I end up going and replying to every last one of you guys when I can. And I even give you a little heart, which, sorry about that afro, um, give you a little heart. So if you guys are interested in that, be sure, of course, to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Sorry that my voice is a little bit lower. Um, not feeling too well a little bit. Plus, I just got through, like, utterly running like crazy this morning. So until next time, everybody, peace out.